I'm tired of this. Tired of what? I'm tired of all of this. Our lives are going around in circles. I don't think we're getting anywhere. What are you trying to tell me, Ronald? Are you serious? I thought we were happy together. No, 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 don't get me wrong, Wendy. I, I'm trying to say is I don't think we're entirely happy is all. I don't feel we're on the right track. We should have some kind of plan for our future. Oh, Ronald. Are you telling me you're ready to start a family? No, no. Well, yes, but no. Well, we should think of something like that, of course. What I'm trying to say is that our lives are going nowhere. I think we need some excitement. Well, I know I do. You're ready, Annie? Yes, I guess I am. What was that? Someone pulled the emergency brake while we were entering the tunnel. No, there's never been a tunnel here before. How do you know? It was all but born on this train. What are you talking about? Well, there is no tunnel here. We are not in the tunnel. Then tell me, Ronald, why is it so dark then? Well, I don't know. It's as if the sun just turned itself off and I'm just simply vanished. I mean, it can't be an eclipse. It's too dark. Listen to yourself. The thought of your life going around in circles is making you dizzy. My life, your life, everybody's life's going around in circles. It's not just about you and me, Dollface. It's about everybody. Humanity can't seem to evolve and learn from its mistakes. I mean, we evolve. We make technical achievements, but we make the same mistakes in more complicated ways. You see, every 10 years or so, there's a major war going on in the world. Better weapons, better wars. There will always be dictators we want to try to get rid of, and there will always be rich people gumming up the works with an economic crisis making the poor even poorer. And there will always be newspapers keeping the fire burning by just throwing gas on it. But now, I'm excited. Something juicy is happening for a change. I mean, this could be the end of the world for all we know. Stop that, Ronald. Please calm down. You're beginning to scare me. What's really scary now is the fact that day just turned into night. Just like that. And your problem is that mankind is going around in circles. Right now, we're simply going nowhere. Don't you think we should figure things out? Maybe we should ask someone. No, stay here. The train guy will probably have an explanation. Come to think of it. No one came to check our tickets. No thunder. That was no lightning. You know that book I was reading the other day? No, dear. You read all the time. How would you expect me to remember just one? That book by that British fella, H.G. Wells. Oh, good lord, don't start with that. The more time I spend with you, the more I question your sanity. I'm starting to think that my father was right. What do you mean by that? Nothing, forget about it. He hates my guts, I knew it. Oh well, I'm glad to get the low down. I don't like him much either. It's your fault. How many times do I have to tell you not to use the popcorn machine at the same time as the microwave? Yes, I like to have butter on my popcorn.
I'm looking forward to getting you there. Soon, honey. <laughs>